just move Good with fuck, yeah Would you go with me? These guys are crazy. I have nothing to do with this. No, I'm just kidding. Oh, yeah. Do you guys mind if we do one of our own songs? Yeah. Alright, this song is called Earthquake. It's currently being played on Life 100.3, and we are so blessed to have it at number four on CT20 across Canada. So, very big blessing for us. We hope you like it. Thank you. How ridiculous. My mother would be so ashamed of me right now, making a mess on my stage. <laughs> and uh, one of my mom's best friends is here, by the way, so she can attest to that. <laughs> um, so as I said earlier, uh, there's some specific things in our lives that God has transformed in. It's one of those things where, where we just know that God has been involved in these areas. And, um, we were super blessed in recording the album that we got to work with uh, the guys from Thousand Foot Crutch. Um, I don't know if you guys have heard of them, but uh, they're this amazing band that we got to grow up listening to. 
And then we got to record an album with, and not only record it, but we got to write it, and um, Trevor McNevin, the re lead singer of Salzburg Crutch, he sang on the record. And um, the one song that he really was pulled to, that he wanted to be involved in, was a song called Wake Up. And it was one that uh, Jamie Applin and Trevor McNevin and I wrote together. And it's about uh, my struggle with um, something called cutting, that probably a lot of you have heard of. And uh, I struggled with depression, and self-harm in various ways for quite a few years. And when it came time to the record, uh, I had been away from it for a little while, but it was all like coming back and it was all swarming in. And we couldn't understand why, and so we started to think about like the fact that this addiction, it just hadn't gone away for good. And I just couldn't stand it, and I thought, like, God, why, why would you keep allowing it to come back? And one thing that we've realized is that, is that uh, as we travel and we get to go in front of all kinds of people, it's an amazing opportunity, and God has, has allowed this in my life for some reason, but, but I believe totally that it's so that we can relate to the people who are struggling with this. And the thing is, there may be some people here today who are struggling with it. Statistics say there are actually quite a few people here who are struggling with it, whether they've admitted it or not to anybody. And the thing is, I want you guys to know that if, uh, if you were to come up after the show or anything and look at my wrist, they're totally clean. And I haven't struggled with it. Well, I haven't done it in quite a long time. The thing is, it's a struggle, but, but I've been free from it and in this amazing way that, that I can't say it's like forever, I'm never going to think about it. But God has allowed me just enough, I think, to, to be able to say that He is in control, and, and I am not, and He's the one who I need to go to on a daily basis, and I'm totally in need of Him. So this song is called Wake Up. It's about the fact that sometimes I get sick of messing up, but honestly, I'm so glad that God has the light, and God is the one that I can seek for forgiveness and for redemption. So this song is called Wake Up. Wake up. 